Greetings everyone and welcome back. Here something useful. The Pico Temperature Gun Project is a do it yourself temperature gun project that uses Pico 2 and GY906 infrared temperature sensor to take temperature readings and display them on the SSD1306 OLED screen. The goal was to create an open source functional temperature gun from scratch using Pico 2 and GY906. A non-contact infrared temperature sensor with high precision of 0.5 degrees Celsius. For this project we created two variants a breadboard version for simple setup and a prototype PCB version that links all the component on a PCB making the entire setup easier and more practical to use Also do check out this project page for more details about this project for getting code and stuff For version 2 of this project we will be designing a custom PCB with a temperature gun style enclosure as housing and an onboard battery pack For time being this video will cover the basic setup and build process for both breadboard version and the prototype PCB version so let's get started with the build The GY906 infrared temperature sensor is a very precise and acceptable device that is commonly used for non contact temperature readings It functions over a wide temperature range from minus 70 degree to plus 380 degree celsius This temperature sensor is highly precise with resolution of 0.02 degrees Celsius and an accuracy of 0.5 degrees Celsius with ambient temperature. It can perform properly with voltage ranging from 3.3 volt to 5 volt. All object emits infrared light as function of temperature. An infrared temperature sensor detect this infrared radiation emitted by an object, convert it into a voltage process this signal to calculate the temperature and then communicate this information to a microcontroller via the i2c interface this non contact approach enable accurate and reliable temperature measurements without requiring physical touch or object being measured as for sourcing this gy906 temperature sensor along with this pico2 we use in this project we got them from pcb ways gift shop PCB Way Gift Shop is an online marketplace where you can get variety of electronics module and board for their genuine price or you could use their PCB Way currency which is called beans you get beans after ordering something from PCB Way as reward points or you can get them by posting any project in their PCB Way community you guys can check out PCB Way if you want great PCB service at an affordable rate and low price we begin this project by setting up the breadboard version We start by placing all four components on the breadboard the pico 2 the switch oled screen and temperature sensor after connecting the wires we input the main code into the device which only displays the current temperature measured by the temperature sensor when the button is pressed now this is the code that was used in this build This project was start by initializing contact with the GY906 sensor and requesting temperature data. The sensor then return a 16 bit raw temperature reading which is converted to celsius by applying the following calculation. When you hit the button the code reads the temperature from sensor and it shows on the OLED panel. Before using the sketch make sure you have installed the OLED screen libraries. We are now preparing the makeshift PCB version which involves mounting all the components on our special prototype PCB and wire them to create a working prototype. To install the Pico 2 we start by placing the female header pin on the PCB. The OLED screen and the switch were then placed on the top side. We attach temperature sensor to PCB's back side. After installing all the components we begin connecting their pads using all the connecting wires. We begin by connecting ground of all components together. Next we connect 5 volt of pico to VCC of temperature sensor and the OLED panel. Pico's SDA and SCL pin which is GPIO 5 and 4 are now connected to temperature sensors and OLED screens SDA and SCL pin respectively. Finally we add GPIO 0 to the button terminal. The wiring process is now completed and our prototype circuit for temperature gun is now ready. The end result of this basic but helpful project is a working temperature gun that shows temperature of media using thermal radiation detected by the GY906 sensor. 
a distance of roughly 1 cm is usually recommended for exact surface temperature measurement but it varies based on size and proportion of the media For final testing of this equipment we made two different coffees a hot black americano and a cold coffee We first measured the hot coffee and obtained a temperature reading of 45 degrees Celsius Next we took reading from our cold medium the cold coffee which gave us temperature of 20 degrees Celsius Cold coffee was not very cold and hot coffee was lukewarm The temperature gun project is functioning and now we can plan the second iteration of this project which will employ the thermal gun 3D printed enclosure and include a custom PCB with a lithium cell to make this whole setup convenient and portable to use. This project was successful overall and I will be preparing the version 2 in the upcoming months so stay tuned for that. Comment if you require any further assistance and all the documents file and code are included in the project article which you can check out. In addition we appreciate PCB way support of this project. Visit them for a variety of PCB related services such as stencil service, PCB assembly services as well as 3D printing services. Thanks for reaching this far and I'll be back with a new project pretty soon. Peace out.